Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to learn the reflex release treatment method for the temporomandibular joint problems. Now the treatment technique that is going to be demonstrated in this video is specifically going to address the problems that are related with the increased contraction or spasm within the muscles of mastication, especially the masseter and the temporalis muscle. Now when these muscles become dysfunctional and they have tender points in them, this often results in problem with the jaw opening movements as well these patients can also complain of teeth grinding and clinching problems. Now again these jaw closing muscles that is the masseter, temporalis as well as the pterygoids can be reflexively inhibited through reciprocal inhibition by activating the muscles that opens the jaw that is the digastric and the mylohyoid which forms the important group of the suprahyoid region. So to reflexively release the masseter and the temporalis muscle, the patient is going to be in the supine line position and the therapist is going to instruct the patient to close the eyes. Next, the therapist can either use one or two fingers and these are going to be placed across the midline under the chin into the floor of the tongue. These two fingers are going to be placed with slight pressure into the floor of the tongue and next the therapist is going to ask the patient to slightly open the mouth and stick the tongue slightly out. This position is needed to be held for about 10 to 15 seconds and then we are again going to reassess for the spasm as well as the tender points within the masseter muscle. Another way to reflexively release the muscles of mastication is to again ask the patient to keep the eyes closed and gently open the mouth and stick the tongue out. And once the patient performs or initiates this motion, the therapist is going to tap multiple number of times again in the same region that is just below the midline under the mandible to reflexively stimulate the mylohyoid and the digastric group of muscles. Again we can go back and check for the tender points and spasm in the masseter as well as the temporalis muscle. This tapping can again be performed for around 10 to 12 repetitions in a single set and three to four sets can be performed in a single session. What is interesting to note is that in majority of the patients, once we start assessing for the masseter group of muscle, we will, we will feel nodules or ribbon-like hardness within these structures. And majority of the patients harbor this tenderness and trigger points within this special muscle. And if we regularly start assessing and treating the masseter, this can help in relieving lot many symptoms not only related to the TMJ problems but also related to the headaches, neck pains as well as shoulder dysfunctions. Do try this on your patients and let us know your valuable feedback. See you all in our next video till then keep learning, keep sharing and stay connected.